a couple days ago, I um, I went to go surfing out at Samoa Beach and for my like evening session after working, and uh, I noticed one of my favorite spots, the old USS Milwaukee, was uh, graffitied all the way around it, and uh, so was the sign that was there, and. Um, I had all my paint with me, so I was like, why not? Uh, I'll just paint it to look like the rock again. And I always wanted to try that. So yeah, I went around the whole thing with uh, paint and, and made it look like a rock and then put the sign back in and all the permit lettering and everything like that and uh, shared it. And Blake Regan, another muralist here, um, saw it. And um, it was around the same time that, uh, that we found out that this mural um, by Dave Patton got graffitied and he was like, you know, inspired by what I did and, and so it snowballed and, and uh, he was down here this morning uh, putting some primer on the graffiti and uh, Dwayne and I were talking this morning and we were both on our way to our own mural projects uh, and we thought maybe we'd stop down here and help Blake out a little bit to uh, bring it back to the way it was and so um, yeah, we're just here to help and we're not getting paid or anything, we're just... Blake needs you know, keeping the Blake city needs clean. Yeah. Yeah, Blake needs help. We're, you know, hanging out, wearing masks. You know, <laughs> six feet apart. Yeah. <laughs> yeah we uh, hand mixed all these to match. You know, the real, real deal. I was heading to my studio the other day, um, and I noticed uh, this this mural got tagged over the entirety of it. So I, I figured not let that sit around and possibly spread like a virus and um, start started uh, cleaning it up, painted over and uh, reestablished the mural's formal glor glory.